welcome back this is nikki from nikki's crafting corner um i'm here again with my boot journal um in the last episode i turned these boots into this li pretty little journal and today i can start to embellish my journal for the embellishment of my little traveler's notebook I have put out um, several things I want to play with. My sewing machine is ready beside me and let's go through it. So I will put the cover away and work on my signature. <clears throat> I really want to have a big pocket on this first page. So let's see what I have. Oh, this is really cute yeah let me do this yeah I want to sew this down so um, but I don't want to sew every single piece and then put my sewing machine away again and so on so I will clip this down with a paper clip and sew this later okay let's go to the next page um do i want to do something here i could have a belly band this is kind of cute Yeah, I think I want to fold the top and the bottom slightly in and then I can sew this on as well. Yeah, that's cute. Okay. This will go here. This is kind of crooked. That's better. Yeah, okay. So what do I want to do with this page? This is a small fold out. I could extend this with something. Let me see what I have. Oh, this would be cute. I could glue this tag down and then have it as a flip out. Oh yeah, I like that. Okay, so let me glue this down directly. Uh, how far does my tag go over there? That's cute. Really cute. This was a blue index card, and I have just done a little bit of collage on top some washi tape, some book page. This is an image from the Danish guide I showed you <coughs> a little reinforced um, sticker inked up a little bit, and just some cotton thread on top to have a nice, sweet, nice little tag. So this is re really cute. Okay, <clears throat> this I want to sew so I have a top loading pocket over there, but um, I want to make a notch. And I like to make one notch, not um, two pages together, but one. So I think then it's easier to go into the pocket. To use the pocket like this and I know I want to do the same on the opposite side so let me make the notch here too <clears throat> and then I can do 
something on the outsides of this pocket. Uh, and I want to ink my pocket a little bit to emphasize that this is a pocket. I have this blue ink. And I'm just going uh, onto the edge with my ink. I'm not doing this like that. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> I think I want to do a little bit of sewing now so um, I can take care of the other pages then. Okay. Okay, after sewing everything on, uh, my pages look like this. This is the corner tuck spot. This is my belly band and you can see my sewing here. And this is the flip out with a pretty tag. And then I have sewn these pockets like this. So these are the first pages in my signature. Okay. Um, Perhaps I want to have a deep pocket here, so I want to sew these edges down later on. Okay, let me mark this with a paper clip so I don't forget. Okay. Good. And then my signature goes on like this. I don't want to do anything to this page and to this one because um, these are perfect journaling pages. But I think I want to do something to my map page. I want this to be a pocket, so I want to glue this down. Let me do this now. And on the opposite side as well. And I want to glue in the middle because um, I, um, I will not sew in my signature. So these pages are kind of loose. Okie dokie. Um, I want to have something on this page, so let me see what I have. Could have this pocket here. What else do I have? Let me bring in again all this stuff. Okay, I have different envelopes and pockets here. This is a map too, but I don't want this on the page. This is too tall and I don't want to rip some edges. This could work. Oh, I think I like this one. Yeah, I think I like this one and I want it to have like this, so it's easier for me to stuff things in here. And yeah, I will glue this down. Uh, and I think I want to leave one side uh, open for another pocket. So... I will have a double pocket. Let me show you. I have my envelope here then and a pocket behind it, like this. 
yeah I like that and I can embellish my envelope later on so I will roughly decorate my um, signature now let me go through the back side of this one and do something there as well uh, let me see what else do I have I have this fun pocket um, there's a pocket here and a pocket here like this and then this flips down yeah and I could glue this on like a belly band so I will have a pocket behind it as well yeah this is fun let me do that and I love the letter X on it okay this is fun like this okay okay I have never um, embellished my books like this going through the signature like this page by page so what I'm doing now is I'm looking at the first part of my page and then um, the same page on the back side. So this is new to me. I have never done it like this. I've always um, done it like this. First page, second, third and so on. But never paper by paper. So um, where's the rest of my signature? Okay, now we come to this page. I don't want to do anything to this coffee dyed page, but I will have to do something with this one. Um, first, I think, uh, let me think about this. I could have a vellum pocket. This is a vellum envelope. Oh, this fits perfectly. I could glue this down like this. And then I have my envelope here. Yeah, I like this. Okay, let's do this. I will put my glue down to the middle of this flap. Otherwise, it would compromise my spine. So, let's see. I have to make sure that my fold is not covered. Yeah. Pretty. And to secure this, I want to have some washi. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, this is perfect. This already starts to roll up. And I don't want this. Yeah, and I will simply fold this over. This washi excess. Okay. That's pretty. I think I want to have something here as well, just to be sure that everything is glued down. Okay. 
that's pretty. Yeah, I like that. Okay, now let's see what do I want to do with this part. Oh. Oh, what about this one? This is too wide. So let's see. It will work when I put it in here like this. I think I want to leave um, this flip down just for fun and I can remove this later if I don't want it. Um, yeah, but I could glue this down. Yeah, let me do that. Where do I want it? Like this? No, I think I want it kind of in the middle. Okay. Okay. do anything to these two but this will be in the middle um, I think I want to have something here on the outside this is a pocket I like that yeah let me glue down this pocket and then I will glue this down like this, so I have a pocket over there, and this is a pocket too. Um, yeah, so let me glue this down on three sides. Like this kind of in the middle, not exactly. Yeah. Okay, what do I want to have here? these. No, I don't like that. Um, can I use my trifold now? Let's see if I glue this down like here and then this will fold out like this. Yeah, I think I want to do that and I want to glue it down again on three sides. Oh no, I have this. Oh no, let's see. This should be a floating pocket because I have a pocket here on the back. Um, or I could sacrifice this and then I would have... Let me fold this in. So now we're talking like this and like this and then I can fold this out and I will have three pockets. 
thought about folding it like this. I'm sorry, but I have to think and no, I like it better this way. Um, I was thinking if I like this on the inside, but yeah, that's okay for me. So I will glue this down here on three sides. Like this. Yeah. Then I have to glue down my pockets here. One and two. Like this. Yeah. Okay, and then I will have a pocket here. Okay. Yeah, I think that's okay. Perhaps I want to have a tab later on here. Okay, but let me close my pocket. Okay. Yeah. So now I've got my middle spread and I think I want to have some side loading pockets this time. Yeah. So let me glue this down first and then uh, do I want to sew this? No, I think this time I don't want to sew. Okay, but I want to make sure that I know there's a pocket in here, so let me make a notch on the inside. Same here. Yeah. And I can do something to the outside because on the outside um, my writing is upside down. So I'm free to use this place for something. Um, I could just glue down some writing space. I could have another envelope. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, I like that. I really like that. So it's see-through and it's another... Yeah, I like that. I will do this. Um, how do I want it to glue this down? I think again on three sides, so I will have a secret side pocket. I love all these secret pockets and tuck spots and things. This is so much fun. Okay, so I've got this 
down. What do I want to have here? Let's see. In my stash, what do we have? So now could be the time for my flip out here. Yeah, I think I will do that. And again, I want to glue this down so I have a pocket here. Okay. Oh, this is so much fun. I love this. This part of making a book. So kind of in the middle. This will flip out like this, and this is a pocket here. Oh, let me put this in here. Whoops, okay. Pocket here. I think I have to turn it around because of my bow. And a secret tuck spot here. Yeah. Okay, and then some writing space like this. Okay, do I want to do something here? Um, oh, I have this boat pocket. This is kind of big. Oh, this could be working. Let's see. I could, could glue it down like this. This would just so be fitting um, like this. So then I can see my pocket here. Um, this is too busy. Oh, this would be fun. And then this could... flip out. Like this. Oh yeah, that's fun. Yeah, let me do that. Let me make a mark where I have to put my glue. Okay. this okay so let's see what we have we have this belly band here and this was well, let me go and get something to show you this is my uh, corner pocket this is a belly band this is a fun tag flip out 
and then we have a top loading pocket here some journaling pages an envelope here and a pocket here pocket here Envelope here, and a tuck spot here, some journaling pages, a pocket here, a pocket here, and a pocket here. Oh, this is so much fun. An envelope here, and a secret pocket behind it. This is a side loading pocket and this too and then we have this fun secret pocket here and this is a flip out with a pocket on the top and some journaling space. This is my trifold with a pocket here. Oh, I already have to glue down this washi. A pocket here, and this flips out. And then we have two pockets here. And I think it is a secret pocket here, yeah. Let me glue this down. Okay. And then some journaling pages and this fun flip out here. And I think I have to remove this corner piece. Yeah. So we have the pocket here and then we have this boat pocket here and this is a flip out as well and a pocket here and this is no and then we have this flip down with a pocket behind it and a pocket here. I really have to do something here. Pocket here and a pocket here. More journaling pages. This is a top loading pocket like this. Journaling page. And then I have this big pocket. I think I want to sew this down and I want to have something here. Mm. I have these pages left. I have made a little notebook and I have this left. I could even this down into this pocket. Um, I thought about sewing this in here so I will have another little mini journal. Oh this would be fun. Yeah I think I will do this. Perhaps I can sew with my sewing machine right down the middle. I hope these are not too many pages. Um, so I will sew two millimeters from the spine. I think I have to sew. And I could sew this down onto the page and then I can sew my pocket here. What is this? And I could even have something fun on the front. So yeah, let me sew this in and then I will be back. So this is what it looks like now. I have sewed in 
this little booklet and it is secured on this page and, and then I have this big pocket in the back so this will go around my signature like this oh this is a fun little thick little book okay This is the first step of embellishing and this is finished for now. And then I can start to fill my journal and embellish my pockets and things, do some collaging, all the fun stuff. Okay, so this is what it looks like now. And I would say this was a success. Um, I have never tried something like this before. And I'm really happy that it worked. And yeah, I can do something with it now. So see you in my next video. Bye.